Hello friends, Dr. Maria Morrison, audiologist, your expert in hearing healthcare, and I just, I had to pop on today. I just saw a woman, she's moved into the area from out of state. Prior to moving about five months ago, she went to an ear, nose, and throat physician for an evaluation, having difficulties hearing, and wanted a second opinion. So I asked her if she had those test results. She did, I said, I don't wanna see them. Let me go through my process, my evaluation, at the end, we'll kind of compare and see if what I have to say matches up with the ENT. So I go through our evaluation. She's having significant difficulties, especially in noise. When she's in a noisy environment, she doesn't understand what's being said. She's feeling frustrated and embarrassed. When her family's trying to talk to her at the dinner table, she has difficulties. I do the hearing evaluation and sure enough, she's got a mild sloping to severe sensory neural hearing loss. So not a medical condition that can be fixed with an ear, nose, and throat physician. It's just nerve damage, recommend hearing aids. We talk about her lifestyle. We compare the, um, I look at her test results. We decide which device is appropriate for her. And then finally I say, how does that compare with what the ENT had to say? And I looked at the, her ENT results and compared to mine, they're almost exactly the same, very little difference. And so at first I was, a little nervous because she came to me for a second opinion and I'm essentially telling her her hearing loss is exactly the same. And she said, what we did was very different. The ENT essentially told her that her hearing loss was normal for her age. What, what, what? Normal for your age? There is no hearing loss that's normal for your age. You either have hearing loss or you don't. I work with children all the way through adults. The range of normal hearing is exactly the same. So they said there was nothing that they could do to help her. She went there for help. And instead of helping, instead of maybe referring her to someone else or talking about hearing aids, they said, no, no, your hearing loss is normal for your age. There's nothing that can be done about it. Really? An ENT? This day and age with all the research we have, that shows untreated hearing loss increases your risk for falling. It increases your risk for social isolation, increases your risk for cognitive decline. And that physician is gonna tell the patient there's nothing they can do to help. I felt so bad. I felt terrible that that was her first experience with a hearing evaluation. So friends, if you get that as your recommendations and results, if anyone ever tells you it's normal for your age, I would question that, get a second opinion. If you need help finding a good quality audiologist in your area, please send me your zip code. I will help you find a provider. If you want more educational information, please hit that follow button. I'm here to help. I'm here to improve people's quality of life through better hearing. And if I can help you do that, I would love to. All right, friends, have a great day.